Hey, what's everybody? Agumon today, and today I'm gonna be talking about something that you should be abusing. That's right. Now, I've actually made a couple videos about it in the past, um, talking about this specific tech, but um, ever since they actually removed the reinforce ability to heal yourself right a lot of people have dropped reinforce and that is what this tech is based off of and it's very similar but it's going to be using something that a lot of people haven't necessarily considered but a lot of more competitive players are abusing and you should be doing this too and that is ring of pestilence so for the most part whenever you use the kind of like the aoe heal everyone version of reinforce right it basically heals you three percent for if you heal somebody else so heal you three percent and one percent per person you heal right and the other person you heal will end up healing three percent right now you can actually half this by using ring of pestilence that's right and so what this eventually like kind of does is it creates basically uh, an advantage where you are healing a lot more than what you're giving to your opponent and it's basically you getting two percent healing every time you use it making it worth running reinforce again so i'm just gonna pop uh, the ring of pestilence here real quick right i'm gonna hit him once and then i'm gonna use the reinforce actually go and hit me again real quick just so i get a bit of damage off all right um now i'm gonna hit you real quick and then use it and bam as you can see i still heal the full percent uh but um what is it called discovery jamal he did not heal as much and so that is basically the big benefit of using ring of pestilence that a lot of people are abusing right now um not just that but just for healing in general but um it's the best way to kind of heal yourself up over time especially if you combine it with like spinning on your opponent and you should just be constantly doing this right if you want to min max the amount of healing you can get in a fight especially in like chime spits and then constantly use like m1 reinforces i'm going to call them especially if you have a very high fortitude do it every time you land at m1 if it's off cooldown bam something like that um and you're going to be able to heal up a ton during a match and we're going to go ahead and showcase this real quick all right we got an m1 off right there so we go ahead and heal up that guy only healed up two percent we got a free two percent healing off of him so just showing like several examples where you could just be using it like just mid combat uh just to pair it up with things like spitting as well um so generally you just want to go ahead and just cycle your spit and your reinforce heals as much as possible and as you can see i already healed up so much because of the little bloodless i got and um what's it called uh that little reinforce plus spit combo dude that thing is like a free six percent healing dude like that that is that's really handy you don't want to really ever lose uh what is it that, that, that's one fourth of a bar is all i'm trying to say right going for a spear right here another m1 reinforced wow look at that that base it, it, i know it's not half a bar but it basically feels like half a bar bro like it looks like i healed up a lot you know what i mean and already from just like two interactions bro that's 12 percent. we just got an extra 12 percent from the fight over a course of fight but that's already an extra bar that you're going to be getting from using this combo as a whole which is always going to be nice and he's already down and yeah, bro, just want to quickly showcase how much you can heal off of it. Again, every time, it's just a free 6%. So make sure to always just be abusing that as much as you can to get the free heals, and that's all. Peace.